For practice at self-check 2.21, count 2, we are asked to complete the following code, replacing the finish me parts with our own code to produce the following output. Okay, so we have a for loop here. So we need to finish the for loop. In our for loop, we have a starter, we have a base, and that's usually int i is equal to 0, normally. And this will run as long as i is less than something. This will be ended with a semicolon, and then we are just going to increment i through this. So every time this loop runs, i is going to become one greater than it was. And then we need to print out. So in here, we will have a string. It'll be two times, and then we see that we have the numbers incremented. So instead of starting this at zero, we can start this at one, add a joining plus here, and say i, because basically what we're saying here is two times, and then i, which right now stores one. On the next loop, it'll store two, the next loop, it'll store three, and the next loop, it will store four. So this will keep going through every single line. We can have a joining for another string which is our equal sign and join this with we can say i times 2 because it looks like i is just being multiplied by 2. In here we just need to find out what is our max value and for here um, since it's going to run four times we can set this equal to or less than we can set this less than five so it's going to run one two three four and then it's going to stop if we submit this we have passed the test and the output that we get looks exactly like the output we're given so this is the correct way to write this code